Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Or if you're new here, welcome to my channel. And today I just want to give you guys an update on how my semester went for the dental hygiene program. So if you guys want to know more, then just keep watching. Yeah, I struggled a lot throughout the fall semester. It wasn't what I thought the program was going to be. Honestly, I thought it was going to be like my <laughs> undergraduate degree where I can just review notes and just take things in and I'll be good. Never did I like realize how much studying it would take to, um, you know, really stay on top of my game and on top of my classes it was it was just a lot it was a lot of work it was a lot of study it was i was stressed there was time where i doubted my ability to finish the program let alone finish the semester i just had a lot of doubts and I, it wasn't just me it was also my classmates it was just how rigorous the program was we were just all stressed out with the amount of tests we had to take back to back. Like we didn't just have one test a week. We had like three or four in the same week. We had competencies we had to study for and also like two other tests. Usually during the week we had quizzes every week in one of our classes like we were constantly studying and I just felt like I needed a break I was over studying if you guys watch my vlogs then like every week I would complain about how much studying we had to endure if you guys are going into this program thinking it's gonna be easy then you might want to change your mind right now just make sure you have good study habits going into this program because if you don't you will you will get killed and demolished <laughs> like we started out with about 25 girls and i think we ended with about 18. i just know like about six of us dropped out before the end of the semester we didn't count the girls after finals in the beginning of the semester it was honestly really hard for me i had a good system going i procrastinated procrastinated a lot first week i was you know studying i reviewed my notes read a little bit y'all i hate reading the textbook but i'm telling y'all right now y'all need to read that textbook if you're <laughs> if you're gonna do this program Read the textbook. If they telling y'all to read that textbook, read that textbook. Because I did not. I hated reading my textbooks when I was in my undergraduate years. I honestly hated it. I would do everything in my power to avoid reading that textbook. I had a good system going. But once they started hitting us with all the tests, y'all, like, towards the end of the month, we ended up having, like, three tests. Three tests within that same week towards the end of September and I don't know I was just done I ended up not doing as well on um, my second exam for that week and I tried to I don't know I was just so upset that I didn't do as well on that second exam that I really didn't care about that third exam I had I just started to doubt my capability in the program even though I knew I could do it it was just it was really stressful and I'm hoping during the spring it won't be as as stressful even though they say it gets better the more you move throughout the program because you start to learn your groove but starting out you know how everything is new and you're just trying to find your way that's how you know that's how, what I was trying to do I was trying different techniques on like how to fully understand the material also trying you know being left-handed I was trying to understand instrumentation as a left-handed person and practicing hands-on and also reading and studying notes and it was kind of hard to to balance I was just trying to find ways on how to balance everything that I had going on during the fall term during the fall term I did not get financial aid I thought I was going to get financial aid to cover school but that was not the case since I already had my bachelor's degree I wasn't I was no longer eligible 
for um, financial aid. I decided to take out an extra loan through, through my bank, but in order for me to get that loan, I had to be in good academic standing. Once they told me that, I was like, you know what? Let me go and just talk with the advisor and see if I'm able to do the appeal process to get this financial aid. That was a long process within itself. So I ended up talking to um, my advisor and financial aid. I don't know, just to see if it was worth it. And after talking to both of those people, they thought it was honestly a good idea for me just to do the appeal process. I ended up getting the aid towards the end of the semester, which was great. I was paying my tuition and books out of pocket and I was working, which was really hard to do. I was freaking out trying to pay for my tuition, trying to figure out how to pay these books. I was trying to figure out ways on how to get my books free so I didn't have to pay out of pocket for some of these books. Overall, this semester was one big, huge roller coaster. But honestly, I had a love-hate relationship with the fall term. And I don't know, if I could go back, I wouldn't do anything differently. I passed, I almost did it, but towards the end of the semester, I was like, I was having senioritis, <laughs> even though I'm not a senior, I was having senioritis. I was over it. Um, I got to the point where, uh, don't do this. I got to the point where I was just like, oh, I'm just, you know, for me, my, you know, I'm gonna just go in and just wing it. And honestly, the semester with, okay, so some of our classes were straightforward and then others were not. So like, you know, one test, you'll, you'll know the format and then like, they'll tell you what's going to be on the test and then when you get to the test ain't nothing that you review was on the test that's how one of the classes were so you know well two of the classes were like you know i just got to the point where i'm just like i'm just gonna go in and just wing it and if i fail i fail i don't know it's just like some of the classes you they were just they were hard, y'all. <laughs> I ain't even gonna lie. They were hard. Yeah, you guys, honestly, I'm still here. I'm ready for, ne not really. I'm ready for next semester, but not really. Um, I start the semester in like three days and be on the lookout for my vlogs again. I'm gonna try to be consistent with the vlogs. It just all depends on how busy the semester is and how much they require out of us. And y'all, the semester's going to be busy, I feel like. Um, we starting to work, not work, we're starting to have classes from 8 to 5 all day. <laughs> Working on each other. That's it for my update. If you guys enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up. Leave a comment down below. And of course, subscribe to my channel if you're not already subscribed. And see you guys in the next video.